Sunday, I wanted to start a tag. Find the piece that started your designer handbag collection. If you've never joined me before, my name is Jennifer. I'd love it if you subscribed. Always hit that notification bell at the bottom so you know when the next video is up. And hit the like button, I appreciate it. My love for designer handbags had to start with Rebecca Minkoff. Before then, I loved handbags. I would look through tons of them at JCPenney's. The design at the time was called Relic, R-E-L-I-C, and then it went to being, um, what was another designer? It was then Fossil, which I love Fossil. Then it went to Coach, and then it went to Michael Kors. Then all of a sudden, I went to a boutique in Columbia, Missouri, and I found this boutique was awesome. It's called SwankBoutique.com. I've been posting a lot about her stuff just because she's been in business for 10 years. Oh, I, okay. When she started, Mom and I happened to wander in. Uh, we were celebrating something. I think I just finished having surgery, and that place that we were having surgery, I had my surgery was Columbia, Missouri, and that's where her boutique is. And her store is so cute. I'm actually going to go shopping there in two weekends because... It takes me a while to get up there, and then when I go, I always find something. Even if I don't, it'll be fun to do it together, so I'll do it as a vlog. This is the first time I saw a Rebecca Minkoff piece. This is the 5-zip wallet. One, two, three, four. Oh, I don't know why it's called. Maybe it's called a 4-zip wallet. Anyway, this was the 4-zip wallet or 5-zip wallet. I can't remember. And it was there in her boutique. And for some reason, I really liked it. This has been in my collection for at least 10 years. And it's held up so good. This is the Rebecca Minkoff plate on the back. It's got some scratches just because I've used this so much. It has a lobster claw. It's in the softest buttery leather. Inside has her signature X's. Let me see if you can see. Oh, here we go. This you just see. Those are Rebecca Minkoff's signature X's. If you ever get her jewelry, that's what her earrings are usually, or her rings. And there's a little metal nameplate for her right there as well. And also a little back pocket. This is a soft cloth lining. But I use this for years as my wallet. It worked so good. I put my coins and my cash in the center section. And then this would hold my shopper cards, grocery cards, and driver's licenses. It's funny, this one has no use whatsoever. It's just for decoration. There is absolutely no space to put anything in that bottom zip. And I can't remember if this one has anything. Oh, it's a tiny area. What do I have? Oh, I have a little bobby pin. Well, that's 10 years ago. And a little safety clip fell out. So I'd like to know what designer piece helped you get inspired to start collecting designer handbags. And I'd love to tag Honey Do Guzman and Charles California. I know I guys tag you all so much, and if you're watching, please go ahead and feel free to do the tag.